Now let's go over how to do this on Robinhood for getting an option. I don't really use Robinhood, which is why I only have $7 in there. That is not enough to get an option contract, but it's enough to teach you how to get an option contract. So we need to search the option that we want to get into. You're gonna hit the search bar at the top. This is what comes up, a big stock screener. Go to the search bar, type in the one you want. Let's say we wanna do Microsoft, M-S-F-T. Microsoft comes up. Click on Microsoft. You're gonna go down to the bottom where it says trade, trade options. Just like Weeble, the first thing you're gonna see is all those expiration dates. April 17th, April 25th, May 2nd, May 9th. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna pick one that you want. Let's say we wanna go to May 2nd, May 2nd. Let's say you think Microsoft is gonna go up after it's been going down a little bit. You're gonna buy a call right at the top and you think it's gonna go up to 390 by the time May 2nd comes. You're gonna hit 390. This is the part where it tells you how Microsoft is currently trading for this exact contract. You can buy it between 10.3 and 10.6. Go to buy the contract. This is your order screen, just like you had an order screen on Webull. You wanna buy one contract to get a Microsoft call of a strike price of $390 by an expiration date of May 2nd. Now what this limit price is, this is what your premium is gonna be. You wanna see how much it's gonna cost you to buy one contract of this option. So you can pick whatever price you want. You can go between 10.3 and 10.6 to get this in there. So let's say we believe we wanna get it for 10.4. That's gonna cost you $1,040. You hit review. I don't have enough buying power because I have $7, but next thing it's gonna say is confirm this order. Now you have that contract. Now you have that call option on Microsoft, hoping it's gonna go up. As you can see, Robinhood's pretty good for beginners. It's easy to navigate, so if you are starting off, maybe go with Robinhood just for ease of use, but overall, I like Weeble more because it is better as an options trader, it gives you more flexibility, and to me, it's just not as cartoonish as Robinhood, but it is a fantastic one to use as a beginner.